If you are not aware already, the state of West Bengal is under a serious medical security crisis. On 10th June 2019, that is Monday, the family of a deceased 85-year-old patient who was admitted to the Neel Ratan Sarkar Medical College and Hospital Kolkata attacked the junior interns who were engaged in the treatment of the patient. Furthermore, they called in a group of their acquaintances who came into the hospital and in a consequent clash between the mob and the junior interns who were in the hospital, a, a medical intern by the name of Paribaha Mukhopadhyay was severely wounded and uh, on, the, on the skull, he was wounded severely on the skull and, ha, and his condition has been critical since. Doshoi Jun, Ratre Vala, NRSA, Kichu Gunda Dadlo Hoi, Akjon Boyshka Manush Marajan, Tar Shei Marajavaki Kendro Kore, Dushojon Gunda, Lori Mutikore, College of Choleashe, Ebong Dakta, their Kup Baje Habe Mari. All junior doctors of the institution sat on a protest movement on the following morning, that is Tuesday. In the midst of these protests that were concerning the security of the medical fraternity and the medicos, uh, several other institutions like the CNMC and even the North Bengal Medical College uh, along with all other medical institutes in the state and also across the country like the AIMS joined into the protest movements. However, in the, even in the midst of these protest movements which have been named the Save, Save the Savior campaign, uh, there have been several mob attacks allegedly with the use of acid and weapons uh, across several institutes like the Bardava Medical College in Kolkata. All government hospitals across the state of West Bengal have shut down their outpatient departments or OPDs while initially only the emergency wards were working. Now even the emergency wards have been shut down. The senior doctors have also joined the junior interns in their demands and protests for security. Even in the wake of such an extreme medical crisis that is uh, happening in the state and uh, in fact is bothering medical institutes and institutions across the country, the government as well as the police administration has been extremely negligent and uh, the student bodies are accusing them of being laid back with regard to this extreme problem. These incidents have compelled the medicos and the medical fraternity to put forth certain security demands before the authorities. These demands are pretty basic and include facilities like the installation of CCTV cameras uh, and also the installation of security personnel on the main entrances and exits. Also, the issuance of certain uh, patient IDs and secure and the visitor IDs for every patient and family and kin members who enter and exit the hospital premises. Uh, despite all these uh, demands and also another demand has been of the installation or creation of a security committee for all hospitals which shall be monitoring the security conditions at all times. As of now, the Chief Minister has not, uh, has not responded in affirmative to any of these demands and has threatened these people of dire consequences if they do not return to work within a few hours. Outsider, both Amade, it is a totally apolitical Andolo. Sheta, a political one on the Chester or some other BJP Shamoto Bolo. It is a Kiko, Abnari, which are on Abnato, exchange of Kitty Hunter. Palti, Ato, Dudin Dore, Goto, Dudin Dore, Kanasti, Dudin Dore, Kane, Alpia, Bangla News Channel, Chilona, Sudo, Ajta, Chilo, or a news eighteen Chilo. Cano. Media, media, যদি বিক্রি হয়ে যায় তাহলে আমরা কি করতে পাবো নিউজে বলা হচ্ছে নাকি پیشنট পার্টির উপর হামলা চালানো হচ্ছে پیشنট পার্টির উপর যদি হামলা চালানো হতে আপনি বলুন ডাক্তার কি একটা দোকান থেকে কেনা টেডি বিয়ার যে যখন খুশি সেটা চটকানো যাবে যখন 200 জন লোক এসে একটা ডাক্তার উপর অ্যাটাক করে সে কি নিজে বাঁচানোর চেষ্টা করবে না Security has been the primary concern of the doctors, particularly owing to the sensitivity of the profession. It often happens that due to emotional reactions to certain immediate losses, the families of patients often get a little too emotional or outrageous. However, this incident was a little too much to bear, even for the doctors. We understand that despite all these, uh, all these emotional outbursts, to expect the doctors to work under such extreme threats to their own security and safety is expecting them to be gods and forgetting that they too have families to go back to. We hope that this movement called Save the Saviour uh, indeed ensures certain concrete steps to ensure the security of the doctors across the country and particularly in West Bengal.